What's up guys, Vary Lasagna here and uh, I'm going to teach you today how to record COD 4 PC without lag. So what you're going to need is these two programs right here. And that's about it. All right, I'm gonna just teach you. I'm gonna just show you uh, what these programs are for. COD for Player is basically like theater mode. They open up demos, which you're gonna record. Demos are what you're gonna record from the game. And VDub is a uh, a program that that uses all like the frames, or and you can put anything in there, and it uh, changes the frame rate and stuff. So we're gonna use we're gonna use demos to record. We're gonna use COD for to pl COD for Player to open them, and then we're gonna record them with. Uh, a program that Call of Duty 4 already has, it's called AVI Demo, and then it makes like frames, and then in here you put them together in, v in a vid demo. So, alright, I'm gonna uh, jump on COD 4 PC right now, so BRB. Alright, guys, I'm gonna show you the settings that I use to not lag and have good quality. So, you're gonna go to Options, Graphic, you're gonna have your video mode at 1280 by 720, you're gonna have your screen refresh at I put it at sick. This is fucking lagging. Fuck. All right, now you're gonna have what I do. Like if your computer isn't that good, you could t you could like take all of this off. But since my computer isn't good, I'm gonna take it off. Wait, what are you waiting for? Just turn it off. Low, low, no, and then apply. So yeah, um, now let's go to this server, start it up. So yeah, now, let's want, now uh, to record, you're going to hit this little squiggly line with the escape key, you're going to go slash record. And then at the bottom you see it says recording demo. And yeah, that's basically how, this, basically how you record when you're playing. And yeah, and then to stop the recording, you just type in squiggly line slash stop record. Fuck, stop record. And then the the numbers go. The numbers that were down there go away. All right. So what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna show you how to. You know, go to your how to find your demos or whatever. So yeah. Okay, so now what you're gonna do is um you're gonna go to your start computer. Yeah. All right. This it depends where you, it depends where you uh saved it. Right, just go to main. So find your COD4 folder. So you're gonna be in your hard drive, program files 86, Activision, COD4. Some people might have it like on Steam or something. So um. Now you're gonna go to all right. If you have like Windows 7, it's gonna say compatibility files here. And if it doesn't say that, your your uh, your recording is gonna be on mods, and it's gonna show like a demo a demo folder or whatever. But since mine is like Windows 7, some Windows 7s might not have it, but mine does. So you're gonna go to compatibility files, and then you're gonna go to mods, and wait. They they like diff the different games. Well, for me, different games have different folders like recording. Like this is Sniper Lobbies, uh, S and D and stuff here. All right. So when you go to compatibility folders, you go to Main and Demos, and these are all the demos here. So then uh, you're gonna need COD 4 Player. So what we're gonna do is you're gonna open it right, and then choose the default program to be COD 4. You know, just browse it and whatever. So now I'm gonna teach you guys how to record it when you're in the demo. So, so yeah, guys, to record, um, once you open the demo up, you're gonna hit squiggly line slash cl underscore avi demo, and then 120 is the frame rate you might want to use. So yeah, you're gonna hit enter. You gotta have it playing at normal speed, by the way. And uh, I like adding 
CFGs. I'm going to make a tutorial on how to use, on how to put on CFGs. So I'm going to just put on a CFG real fast. Ah, oh, fuck. There you go. That, that, that looks very nice. And, uh... Yeah, every time you want to like, every time you're gonna record and like you want a CFG, just uh, either either record first and then put the CFG on, or uh, put the CFG on before you record. So yeah, to stop the recording, you just hit the squiggly line slash stop record. I mean, oh wow, that's the fuck wrong thing. I'm gonna put slash CLAVI demo zero and then it goes normal speed so yeah that that um that fcfg is really nice it's a movie cfg so, all right guys so now we're going to just import the sequences to vdub So this is uh, pretty easy to do here. You're just gonna go find your COD4 folder again. All right. Um, for mine, this is in compatibility files, and then in main. Oh wait, no, not in main. In mods, and then Modern Warfare. And then it says see, see, screenshots. When you hear the screenshots, for other people, it might be on mods and then modern warfare so yeah i'm gonna just put my sequence in you can either go file open or you could just drag it on like that well this is my this is my my um my clip right here my no scope beast and then the things get added at the back like when you record something else, it gets added. Like that, see? That's what we recorded earlier. So basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna video, frame rate, change the frame rate, and then right here you put what si how much frame rate you put. Like for me I put 120. So you put 120 if you put 120. And then you go to file, save as AVI, and then you save it or whatever, wherever you want it. And now, <coughs> you're gonna open your Sony Vegas. You around. Oh, yeah, I also forgot to mention that you also need Sony Vegas. Alright, just wait till it opens. And then, yeah, like, like I have right here on the side, these are like a whole bunch of cracked servers. Because I don't have like the legit uh, COD 4, like the CD. It's obviously downloaded. Um, so this is the thing that you use to record, like this, like the little thing that you type in. So I, I do is just copy and paste it, copy, and then when you go over there, you hit the squiggly line, then you paste it, whatever. Okay, it's almost opening. For some reason, this takes pretty long to open sometimes. Mhm. Mm mm -hmm. And uh, my next video is gonna be on how to get CFGs and skins. So watch that one too when it comes out. <laughs> and then just you just put your uh, clip that you recorded, I mean that you rendered from a vid demo onto your Sony Vegas. Well, I leave everything that I use to render like Call of Duty from console. Uh, the settings the same because it doesn't really make a difference. Um, I'll just if you guys want to have different settings, just uh, I have a COD Four PC settings too that I made on my own. Well, I didn't make it on my own. Um, I saw Element Arts. I don't know if you guys know him, but he has some good render settings on a COD Four PC. Alright, uh, I record on, I mean, I render as MP4, so, he had, like, his frame, his frame, ah, 
His frame size, 20, 2048 by 1152. That's really big. It's a good too. It's nice and smooth. Um, but if you guys want to use mine settings, it's right here. Uh, so what you're going to do is you're going to go to a main concept and just click on any any template. Ah, oh, fuck. And then customize template. And then just copy these settings right here. You can just pause the video or whatever. And my audio, 320, 48. And then project that best. And you just sit, name it up here HD, then hit the floppy disk to save it. And I want to show you my preferences. So you click right here, video preferences, template, put it on HDV 720 by 30p, change the frame weight 5094, full resolution quality the best, and then adjust. I mean, start all these projects with these preferences. And that's it. Just re render it. And that's basically how you record Call 4 PC. This was a long tutorial, but it's worth the quality and worth the wait. So, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.